This is affectionately known as pay to play. What we are going to do is limit, restrict campaign contributions from individuals and companies that hold exclusive no-bid government sole source contracts of $100,000 or more with a government agency from being able to give campaign contributions to individuals running for office or currently elected office holders. in the state of Colorado currently have a high degree of cynicism with the way government does business, particularly this notion of shady backroom deals. They want to see transparency and openness and accountability in their government. Uh, almost 125,000 individuals signed our petitions and repeatedly told us the same thing. Anything you can do to have government do business in the light of day we support. All we're trying to do is bring government contracting out into the public light and to prevent individuals from doing business in shady back rooms and paying off elected officials and government officials in order to get those no bid sole source government contracts. Things that uh, brought me to the table to support Clean Government Colorado and the Clean Government Act is that we reserve options for everybody. We are not like a traditional campaign finance bill that restricts individuals. Our goal and objective is to bring uh, the way government does business out into the open day of light and part of that process of doing business transparently, openly and accountable and being accountable is the fact that Every time a contract is handed out by a state government agency, county government, municipality, it's done through a competitive bidding process. And by doing it through a competitive bidding process, if you then win that government contract, you're still free to give. If you hold a no-bid sole source government contract, you have the option of making the request of the government agency to open it up to a competitive bidding process in order to guarantee your right to be able to give to elected officials and candidates. And frankly, if you feel so compelled uh, to give to candidates for elective office, then don't accept a no-bid government contract.